All right, I'm sure by now most of you understand what globalism is, but have you ever heard the term transhumanism? Most of the global elite who believe in globalism also believe in transhumanism. It's the eventual joining with the human race with machines. And in order to achieve their version of their utopia, you have to die. And their over, overall philosophy or plan to achieve all this is to get you to volunteer to do it for the good of the earth. Once you begin to understand and accept the fact that it's all about global depopulation, everything pretty much falls into line. Pushing masks that don't work lockdowns that have ridiculous rules and introducing the concept of essential and non-essential to the general public. It's all the pre-stages of conditioning the human race for what Bill Gates has called on more than one occasion his final solution. If I show up at your house and try to introduce a foreign body into your body, I would be held liable for doing so. But that's not the philosophy behind vaccines. And some might say, oh, that's completely different. I don't think the people who have suffered horrible side effects and even died from taking vaccines would quite see it that way. If a company or organization isn't liable for what they want to inject into my body, there's no way I'm taking it. No way in hell. As a matter of fact, I'll be more than happy to introduce a foreign body into their system the minute they try. I would much prefer, and it makes a lot more sense to me, than to catch this so-called deadly disease let my immune system do what it's designed to do and take my chances. The media recently made a big deal when Donald Trump suggested there may be a treatment for this most recent outbreak, constantly saying that he's not a doctor. Yet when frontline physicians come out and talk about their results of actual patients they've treated, they're censored and silenced. Why do you think that would be? In my opinion, it's because they knew there was a, was a treatment for this before it even became an issue. Or there wouldn't have been such an uproar when he bought the, up the fact that there was a potential treatment months ago. Based on his track record so far, everything he has said that the media said was completely false and ridiculous has turned out to be true. And it looks like this most recent uproar about a treatment is the exact same thing. I think it may be time to flip the script because Bill Gates does not have a medical degree. He is not a doctor. Yet, thinks he has the right to say that his vaccine will cure the world when his motives, at the very least, are suspect, not to mention some of the things that he has said and done throughout the world with his vaccine trials. He is a globalist who believes in transhumanism and in order to accomplish their utopia, believes that they have to depopulate the world. So what do you think that means in the end? You and me, dead. Because in their view, we don't deserve to be in their so-called perfect utopia.